I found the Caribbean splashdown in this awesome cocktail book, Tropical Cocktails, and I think it fits perfectly with my current trend of tropical cocktails, leaving the out and out sort of tiki stuff to my Sunday night live shows. And let's be honest, tropical cocktails are just fun. They put smiles on your faces and they taste really, really good. So if you just fancy making something fun this weekend, or you've got some friends coming around and you want to make them a drink, give them something fun, not too complex, not too kind of crazy on the palate then I really suggest you try this one out because they will fall in love with it. I mean, it's just a great cocktail. Obviously, we've got some blue stuff in there. Everyone loves blue cocktails, don't they? But, but we've got vanilla combined with Bacardi, eight-year-old. It is glorious, not overly sweet. There's a little bit of sugar syrup gone in there in the form of cinnamon, but it's just, honestly, let's dive into showing you how to make it. Go and make it, make it. Stick it on Instagram, tag me, let me know what you think to it because I would love to see you guys make this. Now the recipe that I'm going to show you how to make is slightly adjusted for my own palate and for a couple of uh, rums that we can't get essentially. For example, the recipe does call for a vanilla rum. We don't really get vanilla rums in the UK. We get plenty of kind of spiced rums with vanilla notes, but they've got other kind of flavours going on there. So instead I've opted to use just a plain vanilla liqueur and I'm up in uh, my base rum, which is going to be Bacardi 8-year-old. Also the recipe does call for galley as well. Note Galliano in the white uh, labels is pretty similar to Liquor 43, so I prefer Liquor 43. If you see Galliano with the uh, sort of purple, that is kind of like a vanilla liqueur equivalent to that. So uh, let's crack on. A uh, lot of booze going in this, so we're going for 45 mil of uh, Bacardi 8-year-old, which I think makes it. I'm then going for my uh, blue Curacao. Uh, so we're going for 15 mil, half an ounce of blue stuff. Everyone loves blue cocktails. Uh, I'm then going for my vanilla liqueur. Uh, so Giffards, we're going equal again. So 15 mil of that. Then we're gonna go for our liquor 43. Not much of this. We just want seven and a half mil, a quarter of an ounce of liquor 43. And then uh, while it's here, my um, orgeat syrup, so I want, or, sorry, my cinnamon syrup. Uh, I want 15 mil of half an ounce of cinnamon syrup. Then the final ingredient is the citrus. Uh, and I want 22 and a half mil, three quarters of an ounce of uh, lemon juice. Now all that's left to do is shake this down. So uh, plenty of ice in your cocktail shaker. And then we're just gonna give it a good hard fast shake. You know the drill. And then to serve it up, this is a gorgeous kind of turquoisey color. I'm just gonna single strain into a decent, this is a 16 ounce glass, but a decent sized glass, um, just over crushed ice. It's a single strain. Then we're gonna to top up with a bit more crushed ice. And then to garnish, I've actually got uh, a drunken uh, pineapple wedge. So pineapple wedge has been soaked in uh, coconut. So I've got a drunken pineapple wedge there. And I could go pineapple leaves. Uh, I've just got some mint there as well. And that is our Caribbean splashdown. Now, if you want another awesome, fun and tropical rum cocktail, you know the drill. Dive into that one right there because that will help you on your rum journey.